friends. Say, Ben. Me and Ben about to go to Duncan, and then we're gonna go to Target because I'll tell y'all on the last vlog they got a candy on sale, so I'm selling to the 19th. What's this taking so long? I just want my donut. Thank you. I see. That you seen? Mm -hmm. So I need some. Look at me. I need some comment to clean my shower. Oh, now they want to bring the brooms back and stuff. This is the broom I normally get right here. But I went with the lip and this time, it's all right. I don't know why she was raving about it. It ain't that good. Where's the comment? Yeah, they're playing this music, ain't they? I don't, I don't want to scavenge for comment. I just want I just want to be there. Found it. Why was Amazon trying to sell comment two for $11 when it's $1.19 at the Target? Oh, faithful. Ziploc bags. I wonder what these taste like. Should we try them? Mm, I think so. And then I also need some creamer. I feel like y'all are so out of focus. Why is they sandwich meat on sale? I mean, they what's not even on sale? Girl, where's the creamer? Got the creamer. These are my favorite toys. So this is the candy I decided to go with. This is on sale for 16. I think this is like $13. This is depressing, but I really got this so I'll be able to eat these out of here. So now I'm about to get some, you guessed it, White Haven. I'm gonna get two bottles of this. It has a lot of pink Mm-hmm. Oh, these look so good. They still skinny, but I guess that's the way they're supposed to be. Which one do you want? This one. That one? Mm-hmm. You don't take your donut microwave? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a little bit chocolate on it. I don't want it. I thought I liked it, the caramel apple crumble. I don't like her. And maybe I liked it because I had used it in the maple pecan. And maybe like the flavor of the coffee kind of like overpowered this. But she's not good. And I feel like I should throw her away. But I think it's also because I don't like Khalifa's oat milk. It tastes weird to me. But I need to say this is back up. When it say it's expired. Bean also had me buying these. Ooh. Right here, we normally get these a big pack of these at Costco maybe. Maddie had been wanting to try the dumplings and I bought dumpling bao, which are the ones that go, they're like breaded. They're kind of like the bread consistency, not steamed. They only have pork, they didn't have chicken. I got me some hamburger meat to make some smash burgers tonight. I don't think nobody else gonna want them, but I did. Yeah, he didn't like the chicken. Eat or bake. Safe to eat raw, absolutely not. I don't do raw dough. But these have cream cheese flavored chunks. Cream cheese flavored? Well, I can't put the real stuff in there. And then, girl, the the one that's made with real milk, I almost end up picking it up because it's sitting right there beside it. Y'all need to make the something different besides it saying real milk in capital letters. I wasn't really paying that much attention. I said, have I accidentally been having the real milk one? Anyways, let me make my coffee. I'm wasting time sitting here chatting with y'all about stuff y'all don't care about. Oh, but what y'all might be interested in is I've been trying to do this whole last minute thing with the Usher tickets to the concert. Y'all know we're supposed to go see them in Miami, but the hurricane happened. Hurricane Milton happened. So we weren't able to go. The tickets going down. You can get the tickets now for $150 and 200 sections. And then we'll sell it for like $400. Some people still have theirs that high. I guess they're like, I'm gonna try my luck and see if I can get somebody to pray for them who's desperate. I was in here opening up the stuff um, that I ordered from Journeys for the kids. I know some of y'all said that y'all be wanting to see the kids close the hall, so I decided to go get y'all. I be forgetting some of y'all moments too and y'all might want to see stuff. So yesterday one pair of band shoes came and I got her tan pair of Converse. I also got her a black pair of Converse because I feel like these are just cheap shoes for them to throw on. Not cheap as in quality, but cheap as in price. These were $35. And then I also got her um, another pair of Uggs. She currently has the like the tan pair, but I got these in a bigger size. They were size eight. Because of the fur, they fit like a little bit tighter. Can you try this shoe on? So I ordered these for Mackenzie, which it's weird because these seem bigger. These are not as thick as the adult ones. These actually fit me, that's so weird. 
And these fit me too. And then for Maddie, she has the black one, so I got her the tan one. And y'all know, if you try to buy these in the in the middle of the winter time or when the winter time actually starts, they all sell out. I just seen these on clearance on there, like some little combat boots, and these were only twenty dollars. What your mom used to tell me, tell you? Run over there and run back. <laughs> It's the shoe. It's into everything in me to stay awake. I can't do it. And then I ain't ate. Maybe that's the other reason why. Anyways, I'm about to make me a uh, a little acai bowl. These little things right here, which is effectively frozen fruit. You know different. Tell me, scoop me. You heard from my kids coming here. It's on my eyeball, son. Uh, uh, this is the grown fruit. Oh, we tried them little um, pork dumplings. That was good. That was good. Them usher tickets slowly but surely coming down. The section right in front of the, uh, I'm, I'm on the phone with my friends. The section that's right in front of the stage or like in the 400s. Them tickets was going for like 15. Hi. These deserve to be. I don't even know if y'all can see this, but this is what it turned out like. It's about to be so good. truth so this is a little bit darker but at the same time i've had these for a while and i'm sitting these on the other end but i think it'll be fine this has a stitching a little y'all see that little thick line right there these don't have that but they're going on the end so they're the accent chairs uh-huh you stuck now ain't you how did you even get in there where are you going anyways y'all happy friday it is also the day of the extra concert have I still been on that site trying to secure some tickets? Absolutely. Sorry if y'all can hear Cletus in the background. Cletus is our shark, our robot vacuum. Now that we had that thing for a while, girl, 10 out of 10 will not recommend because he be leaving crumbs everywhere. But obviously we bought him so we're gonna use him. Anyways, back on task, subject, whatever. So the tickets were dropping so drastically that it was hard for me to just like commit to buying the tickets. So my goal is to try and get them for like two hundred dollars in the one hundred section, they actually had the like section five, section four, section six floor seats at a reasonable price compared to what they were. But I'm sure. So me sitting on floor seats is it's a gamble. Why are you still in here? I really want to pick him up and take him up on about his business because I don't want him in here. So anyways, long story short, I still don't have those tickets for tonight, but we plan on staying downtown anyway, so it doesn't really make a difference. Regardless, we're going to the concert, it's just a matter of where we're sitting. So I'm headed to the mall to take back these Uggs. I could have waited till next week, but I kind of just want to get it over with, and then not only that, we have a baby shower to go to on Sunday, and I think you're supposed to wear neutrals, cream, something. And I feel like I got something at home, but at the same time, do I? This is actually really cute. Nothing in that color, too. And they have the big versions of these little Bottega dupes. They have some cute little purses in there. None of which I needed. But at this rate, I'm going to be wearing something I got at home. Which is what I should be doing anyway. Now, I would be remiss if I came over here and didn't stop by Home Goods. So, I'm going to do, do my part and stop by Home Goods. It's only right. Let me find me a little parking spot real quick. I should just, I'm already in the car. It's already crunk. I should go straight home. It's 11.46. Good thing I'm not a responsible person. Girl, what are you doing? A baby little right here. Now, if I can't find a close part. Hey, it is nothing I need in here. Let me go home. It is almost 5 o'clock. And I still haven't bought tickets yet. I played too much. That's all it is. It's like I cannot commit at all. Anyways, we're about to get dressed. You get complimentary wine and beer when you get here. Get something to eat and hopefully by the time all of that goes, we have some tickets to this here concert. I just need to commit, walk away, and never look back. That's it. By the way, the outfit that I had been saying that I was going to wear in Miami, here, literally I decided I was going to wear that to the brunch instead because when I put on the top, it was giving brunch vibes. It was not giving concert. So they have a floor seat for 380 
that's with the fees. And then the elevated seats are the same amount. In my mind, I'm like, I don't know. I just know I'm hungry. I had a pumpkin donut and chips all day. I think I'm about to do 116 Row W. It's just something about being all the way in the back. For, for $40 or more a person, we can be in row, um, section 115, row M. He just like, just buy the damn tickets. There you go. Okay, so this is the one that I was looking at. Oh, this is way cheaper than what? Shoot, so I should just get these? Sure. Let's go. How do I know what seat they're gonna give me? It says seats one through four. You don't want me to look just a little bit longer? Like, wait until 5.30? Fraud alert. <laughs> Maybe this is gotta tell me not to get them because it's, it just... Mm -hmm. All right, I got the tickets, whatever. Um, Now we're about to figure out where we're going to eat at. We actually ended up paying less than we would have like $100 less than Miami. I don't know how people do this last minute stuff. They not like us, 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 us. They, they not like us. Concert to you. It was amazing. I looked at My bad. I got itchy. It was so much fun. We'll talk about it shortly. We're waiting on our Uber right now. Why she's so cool? It's 12 something in the morning. This man got us walking to an Uber. It's costing us $45. Man, how many minutes we got to walk to him? 17? Oh, 1.7. 1.7 Y'all, I'm tired and it's cold. It's freezing outside. Okay. What? I'm cold. It's cold. Now I'm going to walk up an appetite. They probably can't even hear me because the wind. Riding around in my whip, my whip, listening to my shit. My shit. She wanna hit track six. Track six. She told me that's her. Jeez. Every girl said I got the title. Got a nigga feeling like Michael Jackson. Jordan. Don't matter to me, they both. Jeez. I'm on the way, we ain't got no time to waste Poppin' your gum on the way, am I in the way? No, I won't pressure you none, I want your best in the day Oh, by the way, open the door by the way Told you that I'm on the way, I'm on the way I know connection is big, pick up the phone for me, babe If you have my love and I yeah. give you love, you come for me? Good morning, we're back at home About to get ready to go to McKenzie's game But the Zara package came, so I'm gonna share with y'all what I bought. Is this thing focused? I got some new shades in from Amazon. Brittany from Pockets of Rose. Show these. Well, please. These are sick. The light in here is terrible. Hold on. There we go. Tell me these ain't cute. I think these is like 10 or 15 dollars. I don't know. So I got her a bunch of these crew necks. So I got it in this color. I got it in pink. Got it in a burgundy color. This color with the matching gray sweat, pink sweats. I got gray sweat, cute little Rolling Stones t-shirt. Should have gotten more of these. Four pair of these black leggings. Leah's costume. She is going to be a princess fairy. Oh, you could have got this in a larger size. I also ordered her this little fairy. This was, <laughs> yours is $18. Anyways, that's it, that's the haul. Good morning friends, everybody get ready to go to 
a baby shower. That vanilla 28, can y'all wait? I think it's stained. All right. You see this? This is the outfit that I end up wearing. This is the one I got from Zara and I was about to wear it to the concert. I'm finally carrying this purse that I got from TJ Maxx. And then I'm wearing these shoes. <laughs> I had to bite my toenails real, real quick. I also have these shades, which don't really match, but I should have probably sprayed a little bit more moissanine on it. Cause I feel like it's getting dewy, but whatever. And these earrings are from H&M. The bangles are old from Zara. I guess we'll see y'all a little bit later. The baby shower started at 11. It's 11 I told y'all. I can't never be on time for nothing. Can you get them from Amazon? Mm-hmm. They real cute, y'all see it. Why do I feel like I haven't talked to y'all in forever? I mean, I talked to y'all yesterday before we went to the baby shower, but that was like very briefly. Y'all, I don't know why I be doing this to myself, <laughs> but I'm not a Friday, Saturday, Sunday type of person. I'm just not, it's just too exhausting. But just to recap the weekend, the Usher concert was amazing. I loved it. It was very nostalgic because all of the songs, I appreciated the fact that he really performed or focused in on songs that were like his hit songs from like, I almost said back in the day, I don't feel like I'm that old, but slick back in the day. I did hear that he wasn't able to do three songs on his set list because he allowed Tyrese to perform, which, oh my God, that was amazing. Tyrese still can sing. Um, the Brat, Jermaine Dupri, Big Boy. That, y'all, I love Outkast, so that was amazing. If Under 3000 would've came out, that would've just been the icing on the cake. But it was really, really good. He didn't come out until like nine something, which was perfect for us. Like, we had already heard that he wasn't gonna come out until nine something, so. We actually decided to do dinner. Friday was so hectic between working and then trying to get downtown. We just decided to eat at the hotel, which was nice. Would I eat dinner there again? Mm, I don't know. I seen Lil' Kim. I don't know what they had. They had some party going on at the Epicurean. We seen these two cars pull up and a bodyguard got out. And I was like, dang, I wonder who that is. Yeah, that was like weird. But anyways, we got to the uh, concert literally right as he was, we were getting our drinks. I got my merch and everything right as he was getting ready to go like start the show so it was like perfect timing but from beginning to end it was amazing but the concert lasted till like 11 30. it was i don't know why my camera keeps not focusing on me like my head is big as hell i don't understand why you can't capture at least this part and focus on me anyway set aside from that friday was good we checked out of our room at like eight something because Kenzie had to be at her game by 11.25. Um, dropped off my wig at my hairstylist. My appointment is next week and she's dying my wig. Went and got the kids something to eat. Got to her game by one. Came back home for like an hour. Got to Maddie's game. Maddie's game didn't end until eight something. It was all the way in Roswell. We got home like 9.30. Cause we stopped and got food. Ate our food in the bed because that's what type of day we had. Bean wasn't feeling well. Started not feeling well on Saturday night. So I was pretty much up. You know how that goes when you got a sick toddler. And then Sunday, we went to the baby shower. That was at 11 o'clock in the morning. And then we, we decided to go have drinks or a drink afterwards, which we probably should not have done because the way I'm exhausted this morning, I don't know if I can tell by my face, it's just too much. But I made me some detox and ginger tea this morning. I, I just need to like reset. I took my vitamins and everything. But here, here's the thing. I know there was a lot to recap and it's a lot of talking, but I'm about to close out the vlog. So stay with me, service almost over. I have recognized for a very long time that Sunday should really, like we should not be doing anything on Sunday because Sunday needs to legitimately be a reset day. We need to go grocery shopping. We need to like do a little bit of tidying, make sure we clean the house before the weekend even gets here. So Sunday is really like literally just like a little small reset. And then just being able to relax for the full day of Sunday so that we set ourselves up for success for the week. This is not new news for us. This is not, we're not new to any of this. So I don't know why we do this to ourselves, but at the same time, I appreciate a little spontaneous moment over the weekend where it's like, it wasn't planned. You just kind of like went with the flow, but I am hurting and I'm struggling today because of that, okay? I actually have to go to the office tomorrow, which I don't, I'm not okay with. I will see y'all. I don't even know if I'll see y'all on Sunday. I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Good morning, y'all. So I'm about to get
get ready to go into the office. I don't really feel like it, if I'm being 100% honest. I don't feel that good. Whatever being had, I am now getting. So I just have to go in here for a meeting and then I should be able to go home. There's also a Home Goods slash DJ Max over there. I'm not obsessing over these throw pillows that I have in my in my room, but I just like want to see if they have them. So I might stop by there, depending on how I feel, because right now everything just hurts. I'm about to make some tea real quick, and then we're gonna go into this office. So the meeting was super quick. It only lasted like 30 minutes. It's 10:05. I want to tell you, I went back to my desk, grabbed my purse, and got the on. I don't feel good at all. My face is just aching. Like I need some type of relief. It's aching everywhere. It feels like my head's about to explode. So I'm about to go home and take something and lay down. I'll probably talk to y'all tomorrow. I can't be bothered with no home goods or nothing. Good morning, y'all. I changed the settings back on my camera to auto as opposed to manual. Because as I was editing this video, I was so out of focus and it pissed me off so bad. I actually uploaded the video to YouTube just to see what it would look like if I was watching it as a viewer and it is out of focus and I hate that. Anyways, the last time y'all seen me, I'm telling you how I didn't feel good. Girl, yesterday when I got home from, yeah, that was yesterday I went to the office. That's how out of it I am. What the hell? Hold on, y'all. When I got home yesterday, like, it just all went downhill. I was literally in the bed all day yesterday. But while I was down, the second chair got delivered. I realized I briefly showed y'all, um, I don't know. I just feel like this is why I was moving over here. Thank you, shawty. So anyways, I'm about to open, unbox this right quick and put it in there so I can see what it looks like. With the other one that's been in there, it's not, in my focus, y'all, I can't tell. I'm gonna get ready to take these braids out my hair too because I am so over it. So here's the chair. I realized that I didn't really show it earlier. Well, I actually did, but my kids were in there eating at the time. So it was like really loud and it was very messy in there. So that's why I didn't include those clips. But these Amazon ones are, if you're just like glimpsing at them, they don't look any different, but these are darker than my ones from CB2. But again, I think it's because mine have been exposed to like the sunlight based on where they're sitting and just having them for, I think two and a half years now at this point. And then there's just like some stitching differences. But the fact that these, this one and the other one are gonna be on either end. I was like, girl, they can just be asking chairs if anybody asks why they're a different color, but I don't really feel like anybody's gonna ask that. Um, also, this cushion is a little bit more firm than the ones from CB2. If you're looking for these chairs, I feel like this is a really good dupe. In terms of the quality, the CB2 ones are actually way heavier. Like y'all seen that I was able to pick these up out of the what's the name, fairly easy. Um, the ones from CB2, you would have to actually use two hands. They're way heavier. So um, quality wise, the ones from CB2 are a lot better. Why do you have this one's gonna be yours. So we can finally get rid of this. And you can sit at the table with us, just like a big girl. And these are a little bit wobbly y'all. So that's the other thing, but they will do. So this is what it looks like, y'all. So you can't even really tell. The two darker ones are on either side, and I feel like it's not that bad. And then you also have a pretty good amount of clearance right here. Unless you got big hips, of course, but if that's the case, just, you know, turn like that. But I like it, I think it looks really good. So now, I feel like this area is complete. Yeah, it's cute. I don't know I got that vase and that what's the name to go in here, so I might end up doing that. But probably part of the next vlog, because I'm planning on doing like house related stuff in the next vlog. Um, so I just can keep it contained to one vlog. But y'all see all these little smears? I just cleaned the table. If y'all have recommendations on, like I used, hold on. This is what I used for the one with the vinegar in it. Clearly it's not street free. I probably need to wipe it down with soap and water first and then do it with this because it's probably just grease and stuff on it. I feel like I have something on my nose because I've been blowing my nose all morning. But anyways, I'm about to close out this vlog. Ain't no use in dragging it and I just want to start a new vlog. I'll probably take down my hair. I think I'm about to start taking my hair down and then I'll get into the what's the name. Um, but y'all do realize that next week is November, right? Which means that the Christmas content is slowly but surely creeping up. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't kept quiet on the Christmas stuff. 
And it, it's been so hard when I go to Home Goods not to record not all the Christmas stuff that they have out, but I just told y'all that it was my goal to like really embrace October and not try to rush the holidays or be of influence to anybody to rush the holidays. Oh, they need to be clean real bad. I did my little part or whatever, even though it's been hard because I'm a Christmas girl. I love me some holidays. So not next week, because November is the end of next week. So the week after that, I'll probably start pulling out my Christmas stuff and seeing like everything that I have. But I don't know yet, so we'll figure that out. But anyways, I will spare y'all the rest of the Christmas details. Yeah, that's it. I'm glad I'm feeling better today. I'm way better than I was feeling yesterday. I'm still kind of like congested a little bit, but I think we're on the up and up. So hopefully that won't delay me being able to do like a Sunday video or at least a Wednesday video next week. But <clears throat> I hope y'all have a good rest of y'all's week. Hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. If you did, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I never said that in my videos anymore. Hi, my name is Janae, but my friends have already YouTube. Call me Jenny Jet. If you like the vibe of the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Period. Give the video a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Also, if you're not registered to vote, make sure that you register. And if you are or when you become registered, make sure you vote. Early voting is going on right now. Don't let anybody convince you that your vote doesn't matter, that your vote doesn't count. We need everybody out there voting, especially if you live in Georgia. But everybody around the world, regardless of where you are, you need to vote. Okay, that's my little tidbit for the universe. And I'm going to go now. <laughs>